my name is Staff Sergeant Janice Kim with the U.S. Army Bay in Pershing Zone. Today I want to talk about obo tonguing. Tonguing is a technique that we use to create different notes. Often refers to articulation, which is how we start the note and how we release the note. Tonguing and articulation term can be used together since we use tongue to stop the air or allow air to flow in the mouth. So different articulation tonguing could um, let us play different notation of music that composer have written, which can be leading for a different style of music or set the different tone of the music, um, different kind of music that we can play. Basic oboe tonguing, you just gotta remember one thing, no matter what, you gotta have continuous air flow through it. We use the tongue to interrupt the air. Remember, I'm not saying we're stopping the air we're gonna interrupt the, the air with our tongue. Tip of the tongue touches the tip of the reed to interrupt the air. Keep the air moving while doing so. So I wanna practice with my reed only because it's much easier. So let's try to do half notes, quarter notes, and eighth notes. I'm gonna turn on my metronome to 60. I'll do different things. I wanna tell you the syllable that I'm thinking while I'm doing so. I use ta. Um, I always think about using the syllable ta while forming the good amateur to create the tonguing sound. So remember, I'm not doing, I'm not stopping the air. Like sometimes the composer wants to want us to stop the air really quick. It's called staccato, and that sounds like this. You can use different syllable to figure out what's comfortable with you, but that's basically what I do. Remember, we're not stopping the air, so we're not doing... We're not doing this. We want continuous air flow, and we're just interrupting the air with our top of the tongue. You can see I'm not using my mouth or jaw or head or body to stop the air. <laughs> 